uh, today we are standing on Boko Mountain again on the second day with uh, about uh, 60 uh, Cambodian journalists uh, coming as a press tour to, to promote Boko Mountain. Sir. Uh, sir, following the question from yesterday, we talk a lot about our press tour currently. But uh, today I want to focus a bit more about the future of press tour, not just only for CCJ, but also uh, Cambodia as a whole. Uh, sir, um, we do with Cambodian journalists and mostly they do it in Khmer language. Of course, it's very good for our domestic uh, consumption. But, uh, sir, I mean, in the future, do you think that you will, let's say, gather um, foreign uh, reporters or foreign journalists to do a lot more about Cambodia, sir? Uh, well, as uh, what you said, this is the uh, first step for Cambodian journalists that we try to organize the press tour to different uh, places, different uh, cities and provinces. So in the future, a club of Cambodian journalists wants to uh, conduct, you know, uh, more press tour to all 25 provinces and cities and all sites that are potential, not only for tourism, but also for culture, for mm. agriculture, for industry, whatever. Yes, sir. Uh, and in the future, uh, club of Cambodian journalists also wants to connect, to link uh, to the uh, international uh, press, to uh, news agencies, to foreign reporters yes, uh, to come uh, over to Cambodia to witness and also to uh, highlight and, and uh, report uh, these kind of potential uh, sites in Cambodia. Uh, of, of course, a, a foreign uh, uh, journalist uh, often come to Cambodia, but uh, mostly they focus on a politics, yes, on culture, and uh, on foreign affairs, oh, yes, but not much about tourism. And Cambodia, of course, is uh, very much uh, rich in uh, tourism. And uh, of course, and also we understand that tourism is one of the uh, uh, important sector, the major incomes for Cambodia, in addition to agriculture, in addition to uh, uh, garment sector, for example. Yes, so uh, why not? Why not we try to uh, highlight uh, these kind of things to uh, well, international uh, uh, tourists to come and you know witness and enjoy so many uh, tourism sites in Cambodia. Not only coming to visit Angkor Wat, not only to the uh, seaside, to the beach, uh, uh, Sea Hanuk Wheel or Cap or Kompot, but we also have uh, many places. Yes, uh, why not to like Boko uh, Mountain? Why not to Kiri Rung? Why not to Mondulkiri? And many other places in Cambodia. Yes, sir. so the tourism sector can be the first stage uh, of a press tour in Cambodia. So in the future, just to confirm, maybe we can do about industrial tourism, educational tourism, fishery tourism. Those are the ongoing steps, sir. Exactly. Uh, yes, sir. The uh, fishery is also very, uh, uh, you know, important uh, sector in Cambodia. Uh, yes, you sir. know, uh, is rich uh, in uh, fishery. Yes. And, uh, understand how big, how large Tondesa are in Cambodia, and of course Mekong River across uh, many countries in Southeast Asia. And uh, so Mekong uh, River is also one of the uh, uh, resources for irrigation network, and of course it's the, 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 uh, the place, uh, the sanctuary, I mean, uh, for uh, people living along the Mekong River and also the sanctuaries of the, uh, the, the the arms of the river and Cambodia you know uh, the irrigation network of course is not that uh, uh, rich but anyway the water we can see everywhere everywhere so it needs to uh, uh, tell the world that need to be promoted yeah, further uh, the the point is that we don't have much uh, mm. reports uh, or how we say inform the world how yes, how, how good uh, in Cambodia has and uh, just only in the past you know uh, by literature by book they write about but sometimes it's too old too old that we need to update need, yes, yeah sir, and, yes, and, and journalists play very important role to update those current issues sir. yes uh, not issues but more like uh, activities sir. exactly exactly yes, why, why not why not journalists uh, try to do these kind of things and I want to uh, have uh, first the Cambodian journalists do this job Yes, sir. as priority and the second step then why not invite a foreign a journalist to come out yes sir. from different different countries not only from asia but also from europe from america 
Yes, sir. And also uh, the second question and also might be the, the last question, sir. Because uh, normally we do press tour in a uh, site which is, you know, static and, you know, normally it, it is here. But, sir, is there a possibility or maybe it has happened? I'm sorry, I might not uh, know a whole. Um, is there like a possibility that we can do a press tour for event? Let's say, for example, on Kosenkran, where we invite, you know, press from the region, or maybe, uh, you know, let's say, water festival of Shuman Day, or even more than that, maybe we can do a press tour on specific uh, thing, for example, geographical indication product, let's say palm tree, or maybe a pepper. Do you have any I, you know, plan for that? Oh, uh, until now, I myself uh, personally approach yes, sir. by foreign media, but individually, I mean, from certain media, it's not as a group. Yes, sir. In order to invite foreign media to come over to Cambodia uh, to, uh, you know, this kind of report, uh, Club of Cambodian Journalists is the one that can work on this. Mm -hmm. And this is what uh, uh, CCJ will, uh, you know, uh, start yes, to sir. approach uh, foreign media to cover this kind of particular events yes, and particular uh, topic and product that Cambodia has. Yes, sir. So it's going to be a bit longer. <laughs> uh, exactly, <laughs> exactly. Yes, and yes, also sir. as a experienced uh, veteran journalist, uh, you've been to many places around the world to a press tour in other countries. So is there any particular press tour that you feel attached the most, sir? Um, I travel a lot to many countries and of course uh, in the name of the press tour. Yes, sir. Uh, basically, you know, every country they are so much keen to invite journalists to uh, their countries. Yes, sir. And they want foreign journalists to understand the culture, to know about the uh, potentiality of uh, any things that they want to prevail, they want to show the world. Uh, recently, you know, this Club of Cambodian Journalists uh, also traveled to Vietnam, the mm -hmm. northern part of Vietnam. Yes, sir. Uh, it is also the mountainous area. Uh, Sapa uh, border with uh, China. Over there, you know, the authority, the uh, Vietnamese authority, the local uh, company, uh, they s were so well prepared, helping, mm. guiding uh, journalists to different places to see what uh, they have done, what they are doing, and what will happen in the future. Briefing presentation, welcome. So I want to see Cambodia, especially the authority, the government, and all, all stakeholders. Yeah, yes. stakeholders continue to pay attention, to support, to cooperate, to help journalists as much as they want to do their job in order to tell the world, to tell the people that uh, they are helping the country. Yes, so all the reports will help the country, especially about the tourism, about the culture, about the agriculture, whatever Cambodia has. So uh, I appeal to a relevant authority that please continue to support journalists, whoever that want to uh, touch upon uh, this kind of topic that the, to show the good image of Cambodia to the world.